Hi everyone. The Harkin Engel Protocol was an international agreement against the worst forms of child labor. It was signed in 2001 by all the big players in the cacao industry. But in 2004 it seemed that none of the companies that signed the protocol were upholding their agreements. The Dutchman Teun van der Keuke took the matters into his own hands. He recorded himself eating 17 bars of chocolate and subsequently took himself to court for knowingly purchasing and consuming an illegally manufactured product. To make a case against himself, he convinced four former cacao plantation child slaves to testify against him. The court ruled that the case was outside the jurisdiction of the Dutch Attorney General and Teun started his own brand, Tony Chocolonely, an alternative for slave-free chocolate bars. Over time the industry proved hard to change, so they had to change the tagline to striving to be 100% slave-free. This week was announced that Tony's Chocolonely chocolate bars will be going public. This week I will be playing a game that puts your workers to work trying to give your tribe the victory. This week I'm delving deep into the world of cacao. Cacao is a tile laying game. When it is your turn you put one of your own worker tiles on the board. Orthogonally, my new favorite word. The number of workers depicted on the tile that you place decide the strength of your action. And on most spots you will be allowed to add another tile to the board. And so you collect cacao, money, water, sell to the market or get the majority, try to get the majority in the temples. The game is easy but still has some great choices in it. It plays fast so it's great as either a filler or a family game. A big recommend for me for Tony's Chocolonely Slave Free Chocolate Bars and for the game Cacao. My name is Dave Luza. Thanks for watching. 